Agape Care Ministry, Papua New Guinea, was established in 2008 by Mondo and Nancy Carmar. The ministry was born from a desire to show the love of Jesus to the people of Papua New Guinea through practical acts of kindness and compassion. The ministry does this in a culture that is often filled with ethnic strife. Violence between tribal groups is becoming a more common occurrence in the nation. On May 17, 2010, 4,000 members of the Sipic tribe had their homes looted and burned because of tensions between two tribes in the Bulolo region. Mondo and his family were among those who lost nearly everything. My first house, permanent house that I built, was also among the houses of uh, my uh, mother and father-in-law's place, so it was also burned down. We were very worried. But I praise the Lord that um, through ACGC ministry, they uh, funded my building again. Mondo and Nancy don't harbor ill will towards those who harm them. Instead, they have chosen to love those who hate them by serving the people of other tribes in various ways like feeding programs, medical clinics, and literacy programs. Mondo does this because he believes that these acts of service will open up hearts to the gospel and that ethnic violence will be overcome by the love of Jesus. I believe that with the word of God, in, uh, with this uh, leading of the Holy Spirit, nothing is impossible. We can bring peace to places like this that have a lot of ethnic uh, problems or uh, fighting uh, places. So for us as uh, vessels of the, go uh, of the Lord, we just open ourselves to Him and ask Him to lead us through His Holy Spirit and reach the lives of those people. And I believe that we can bring peace. We can change uh, the lives of people. Jesus commanded His followers to love their enemies and overcome evil with good. That is exactly what Agape Care Ministry Papua New Guinea is trying to do. Mondo blesses those who have persecuted him because Christ's love compels him to give his life in service to others.